Oh, they left in the G because the G stays in you. Big Jeff with capital G. So how was Burbank, bro? Man, I loved Burbank. Burbank was so exciting. It was full of energy. But uh, the hobby is full of passion. Yeah, we had a lot of people go down there. Show me some highlights of what All you right, picked let's up. let's see what I uh, picked up at Burbank. So Jason Tatum is my PC. So that is an artist proof out of 25. You think they're going to win it this year? I do. Man, I open. Do. I do. I Every time I say they are, they get freaking put yeah. out. All right. What else? Tatum Green. Beautiful. Beautiful. This was my favorite pickup. Shout out to Coleman Cards. What a great guy to work with. Um, real nice, uh, transparent. He actually uh, saved this card for me for a couple days. That's dope, And bro. Uh, the show ended, came back, and we made a deal. So real fortunate. What a nice guy. Coleman Cards, big shout out. Awesome, bro. My gamble for the Super Bowl, he lost, but uh, I don't bet. I'll buy cards and bet. So Same here, I, bro. I grabbed a Jalen Hurts. And then uh, we got a J-Rod. Um, we're in Seattle, I'm from Portland, but I grew up here in Redmond area. So uh, J-Rod, auto out of 50 from the National, PSA 10, pop one. Beautiful, what's today a J-Rod show for you? Today was a J-Rod. <laughs> Absolutely. Um, All right, I got my boy Will. What'd you pick up, Will? 1988, um, Michael Jordan, the die cut Michael Jordan, in uh, Osaka out of uh, 150. PMG? PMG. Right. Appreciate you, bro, as always. Thank you. Yep. Yep. So is it Jeff or Josh? It's, I got... it's Josh. It's Josh? All right. <laughs> Shout out your IG real quick. Rain City Cards. Rain City Cards? Yep. Now, you are the man of the hour, the man at the Seattle show today. Tell everybody about the card that you got in a break. Well, I'm a big fan of, obviously, Julio Rodriguez as, as one of my favorite players, as you can see right here. Uh, I wanted to chase specifically a Ben Baller Julio because I've become friends with Ben over the last couple of years through the pandemic. Wow. And we chat a lot. And he's a Seahawks fan, comes up for games, and he's an all-around great guy. And I, and I like what he does, love what he does, so I want to support him while at the same time chasing a big card. One of the guys who I've begun to uh, build a relationship with and break with often is Ben from Midwest Box Breaks. Okay. And so whenever he has a PYT coming up, and I think there's gonna be a Mariner spot available, I usually set my alarm and I'm there at 5 p.m. or whenever the, it's released and I try to grab my team. And this specific time, I got the Mariners and it wasn't, I don't even think it was a full uh, case break. It was like a four or five box or something like that. And then I forgot about it, went on vacation with my family. <laughs> and uh, like almost two weeks went by. And for whatever reason, I think there was a delay or something. And it didn't get ripped until it got hit last weekend. Um, and I'm coming back from vacation. And I see him post this card. And I'm like, mother. Oh, I was like, somebody else hit the 101 in Ben's breaks. You got to be kidding me. Because I thought that my break had been ripped like a week earlier. Right, right, right. And so and he didn't tag me in the post, which I saw. So I was like, oh, it's not my card. He would have tagged me for sure. And then I, I, I post that up. And then a couple hours later, he messages me and says, hey, dude, that's your card. And that was the first time I and realized what, and what, it. Say what card that was? The Julio Rodriguez one of one Super Fractor uh, from the Ben Baller Top Scrum Series. Man. And uh, hey. You put it up on the screen with your fancy software. I will. I, will. I was going to ask you, did you bring it or do I put it up? No, I'm not going to bring that to a, <laughs> a show like this. But the fact of the matter is, is that, you know, he knew, he knew I was chasing Julio. Right. You know, and and I right away, I, um, the first thing I did was I went and watched the video and uh, on my Twitter account, which is at Rain City Card. Right. Uh, I posted the video of it. And uh, until I saw my name against the Seattle Mariners on the list, and I watched him pull the card, that was the moment when I said, okay, this is real. And then I still woke up the next morning and I'm like, thinking in my head, oh, I had a craziest dream of it. And then you realize it's actually happened. No way. Justin Decker, Rain City. Oh my God. Oh 
Oh my god, I'm terrified. Hey, let me, let me ask you this. Did it pay for your vacation? Uh, it paid for that <laughs> vacation, and uh, I'm taking my family on a three-week trip to Italy this summer, and oh. it probably paid for that vacation, too. Well, congratulations, yeah. man. I just wanted to definitely highlight you, and I just want to say congratulations. I'm glad we brought one home to Seattle. You know, the best fan base in baseball. I might be a little biased, but uh, I'm asking everybody one more question before we go. I got Julio hitting 34 home runs this year. Over or under 34 home runs over. for Willie. I over? got him. Uh, I got him in the 40-40 club. Oh, he's got he's Canseco, got bigger bases. Canseco, Bonds, A Rod, Alfonso Soriano. Anybody else I'm missing? Did Acuna hit that? Did Henderson ever hit 40? Did Henderson, no, no, no he no, had 40 no. bases almost no. every year. But all right, all right. So we're two for two on people going over. But anyway, congrats again, Josh. Hey, thank Appreciate you. Appreciate you. Rain Appreciate City it. cards. Thank Look you. Look for the card online. I'm gonna get it graded next week. Um, I'm not sure which way I'm going with, but like everybody. And their brother is trying to get me to send in the card. Beckett, PSA, Golden, PWCC. I got some decisions to make on where I want to sell it and how I want to sell it. Um, and uh, I just, I'm, I'm really grateful for the opportunity of representing Seattle and uh, also reducing the price of the Seattle spot and all those box breaks for you guys out there. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely, Thanks. appreciate Take it you. Easy. Thank you. Thank you. What did you pick up today? Let's today see that. I picked up the uh, Bowman Transcendent on card auto man look at that beautiful i love the gold frame transcendent autos beautiful pieces of art and then uh it was a big trade he got a lebron james 2008 x uh fractor psa 10 something i really didn't want to trade so i wanted to make sure it was worth my while so i got the ripped at a 99 as well beautiful the orange 3D out of 25. Nice. A Prospects Bowman Speckle. Another Prospects Speckle. And then two of the Bowman 3D Golds. And a J-Rod. I don't really do Panini, but it's out of 50. Color match, I don't know. Beautiful. One more question before I let All you right. go. Thank you first and foremost for showing me. I need the over under Julio home runs. I think Julio's going to hit 34 home runs this year. Over or under? Oh, dude, he's going to smack 45 plus. 45, let's 45 go. 45 plus. All right, shout out. All right. Shouts out to Jeff, man. Thank you, sir. Appreciate you. All right, great day one of the Seattle show. Last show before baseball season. We're calling today the J Rod Show. Back to the show. You know what time it is. I didn't pick up any J-Rod shows, and surprisingly, I sold a lot of basketball today randomly, but I'll just run through what I picked up real quick. Quick little $100 lot here. Buxton Auto. Bobby Whip Blue. Judge Beam Team, number to 50. Gold Acuna Allen & Ginner, number to 50. That's the kind of stuff I'm looking for. Uh, little lots I can grade. Um, people were asking me for Cade Marlowe today. Surprisingly, someone asked me for this, and then the next person came up with this gold shimmer number one of 50. Picked up these two, like 290 bucks for, or actually it's like 370 for both, so good deal on that. Jackson Holiday, Cade Marlowe, and then this was probably the biggest uh, lot I picked up. I love this Topps Chrome Cosmic, so I got the Machado. I'm trying to pick up San Diego Padre stuff. I think they're going to do well this year. Machado, Jim Mintane, Orange Galactic Refractor. And then the Miggy Hall of Famer, Team Venezuela World Baseball Classic, 2021 Allen and Ginter autograph. Beautiful card. All right, I got my boy Drew. Show him what you picked up, Drew. Yo, man, John hooked me up. I got this, uh, this PSA 9 Mint. Uh, Shohei Otani uh, got this Mike Trout numbered out of 199. Then I picked up this Aaron Judge sweet deal. This is numbered out of 50, 25 bucks for that. And then we got, you know, we're in Seattle, so you got to get go. some Julio Rodriguez. So All right, that's what hey, we're picking I'm, up, man. I'm asking everybody one question. I think Julio's going to get 34 home runs this year. Over or under? Oh, over. I, over. 40. 40. 40. I like Guaranteed, it. I like it. You man. got IG? 
I got an IG, so you can follow me at Drew, D-R-U underscore Jams, J-A-M-S. I appreciate you. Thank Sweet, you. Sweet, man. Thank you, Thank Drew. you, John. Yep. Yes, sir. All right, we're back with the hardest working man in the oh, hobby, God. Sam. Yeah, yes, Sam, sir. I am. Sam, I need a wax report. What's good on wax right now? What's good on wax right now? You got maybe one or two more chances at getting, you know, like the sets with Julio and stuff in it. So maybe like Stadium Club Chrome. I think it's still coming out. I think, uh, what was it, Bowman's Best. You know, both of those might do okay. And then you kind of just start, got, you got to start being careful about stuff. You know, like uh, I think a lot of the new waxes coming out, you got to just make sure, you know, the checklist looks clean. The checklist looks clean. I always like to buy the Topps exclusive products. You know, like when uh, Ben Baller came out, Bowman Sapphire, like anything that's exclusive to Topps that's not going to hobby shops. Like that's the stuff that once it sells out, you might have a little bit of additional value to it, especially if there's like a cool chase set or a cool auto checklist that comes out. I think you get it, you get into some of that stuff. You want to buy stuff that like tries to, you know, the stuff that sells out. You know, people always have FOMO. We're in the Dutch auctions on Panini and things like that. Do we think 2022 baseball is a go-to product or what? 2022, oh yeah. It's 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 2022 baseball, so 2020 football. It's Absol 20, absolutely. Absolutely. I and think that as well. I think the last time we were talking, we were talking about Topps Chrome with the fiasco of regular Topps Chrome. Bowman yeah. Chromes came out, yeah. all the Sapphires, yeah. Cosmics, everything like that. I yeah. think the singles will have some value with that strong sure. rookie class. Also, sure. Albert Pujols being in a Cardinals uniform. Yeah. Um, and then Topps on-card autos are always so clean. So, yeah. Um, yeah, yes, I just sir. love that. I think with other sports right now, me and you were kind of touching base, uh, specifically with football right now. You kind of mentioned being first to first to market with some of that yeah. stuff, right? You wanna, I, th I think the one thing that's really important in cards right now, you want to do the work that no one else is doing. You know, a lot of people they're ripping stuff, they're not grading it, they're uh, they're not, you know like they're they're ripping a bunch of stuff and they're not comping you know certain cards or certain hits and stuff like that. They're throwing in their bins. That's kind of where you gotta edge when you come to card shows and you 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 do the research, you look into stuff, you grade stuff. You, 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 you're quick on things. Like, right now it pays to be quick and do the work that other people aren't doing. Because, I mean, if, if you're just ripping stuff and you're holding it, you know, like your $10 Kenny Pickett, that's that's right now, that just came out of Donruss, is gonna be like a two, a two dollar card in a month, month, month or two months. And if you grade it right now, you get a 10, be first to market, you might make 60, 70 bucks on it, you know? So you gotta, you gotta like do the work, you know? Like, I think people spent the last two years just, you know, like, going to Walmart, going to Target, clearing out shelves, making 20 bucks a blaster, and then it's easy money. And now that it's difficult, people aren't doing the work. And if you, if you do the work, you still can enjoy the hobby and still make a little bit of money off of it. But then a lot of people just aren't doing the work anymore. Absolutely, setting boundaries for yourself, being quick, exactly. being first to market. Thanks for the info, Sam, appreciate yeah, you. Sure. got you. The full scoop of hustle. Ooh. All right, you know who it is, my boy Lincoln. All right, Lincoln. what's up? Did you have a good show? What'd you pick up? It was a good show this weekend in Auburn. Got a couple pickups, a lot of buying, selling, trading. Uh, first pickup, Damian Lillard, flawless. Love Dame. I'm from Portland, so I'm gonna hold on to this one. Oh yeah. Next one, uh, Jordan Poole, on card auto, rookie auto, nice. Nice. That'll move easily. And then last pickup, big one, Mahomes Color Blast, PSA nine. Woo! Beautiful card. Oh yeah. Excited to pick that one up. So good show here this weekend. Um, did you make did you make a bet on the uh, on yes. the game? Yes, I bet uh, the person who's holding the camera right now, twenty bucks that the Chiefs would win the Super Bowl. Oh my Went lord! At least he was, paid up. At least he, he paid, paid up. up. He paid up. It was, All right. All right, bro. Appreciate right. you. Yep. Appreciate you. <laughs> all right, big hefe. All right, all we right. Had a, we had a busy weekend. We had a real busy weekend. Um, I don't do a huge amount of hockey. But um, we have the Kraken here in Seattle, so I got some Maddie B. Um, a lot of people ask for the Maddie B. Good old Julio Speckle, first bumming. I like O'Neill Cruz. Me too. So a couple of the short prints. Um, I got the bigger one down here, the actual Ultra. Okay. And I was thinking this could be a crack out candidate the SP Julio but there's a butchered corner so okay I might do it I know it wasn't gonna be a 10 I might try to get a PSA 9 but I would we'll leave see. it I would leave it personally little jambalaya Shane Wright Shane Wright cracking got a big game tonight Cade Cunningham numbered nice at a 49 Oh man, my boy Jaw. Hey Jaw, 
put the strap down. Doesn't get you What's anywhere. What's he doing? Another Tua, or a, sorry, another auto grade. Nice. What's that number, 2150? That one is number two, no, 99. 99, okay. How about some Kellenic? He's doing all right. What do you call him, Mr. Wilson? The, or is that someone? Four time uh, MVP no. of AAA. He's a, a, he's a bust four, in four the MLA. A baseball player, bro. But I hope he has a good year. And then uh, a Julio. Holiday's not my favorite, but a Julio. Julio Ada. Ada. All right. Was right. this weekend? Was this weekend the J Rod show you thought it would be? The J Rod show. All right. All right. Thanks for all, right. all the content, sir. Appreciate you. Thanks for everything this weekend. You too. So it looks empty. That's because we've been busy all weekend, so we never have time to shoot the videos. But I'll show you what I got real quick. Julio Finest Refractor out of 300. Got this deal from Hefe, Jeff behind the camera. Pujol Solar Sapphire. O'Neill Cruz Blue Logo Fractor. RCR BGS9. I'm going to crack them out. Send them to PSA Nine though. 95. Nine I'm going to crack them out. Send them to PSA since the PSA president was walking around here today. <laughs> Uh, the Julio Tops Chrome Cosmic, number to 99. I definitely was seeking this card out. I love the Cosmic. Got that in, in conjunction with this. Jordan Alvarez, Future Stars, number three out of five. Red Refractor. Jordan's going to have a big year. Picked up these. Five Kale Makar Young Guns. Four Raw, one PSA 9. Going to grade the Raws, obviously. Big game, cracking in uh, Avalanche playing tonight. Time to this point. Now, Yanni Gord is in. He scores! Hey, hey, what do you say? Yanni Gord wins it. And from my boy James, House of Cards, I got the Jalen Hurt Shadow Box. I just picked up the Burrow, and I got the two on this as well. So I just got the Jalen Hurts. I wanted the one number to 99. This one's number to 75. I think it's the blue, but I'll take it. It's got a little bit of scuff on it, so I'm going to have to open it up and clean it. And then this, I wanted to show this. So I just got this back from BGS. Anybody interested? Marshawn Lynch, flawless. 2016 Patch Auto Gold. One out of five. Um, I believe this is the highest graded BGS flawless Lynch in existence. I collect the 2014 patch num auto number to 25 so definitely want to throw this one up for sale and highlight it because i just got it back so um that wraps up the seattle show thanks jeff thanks for all the content appreciate you peace thank you for checking me out make sure you like comment show that ultimate love and subscribe thank you for watching seattlesportscards.com content